Alright, what is going on guys? It's Apollo1 and today we are back with an absolutely insane gameplay. This time with a 100 KD gameplay with the brand new FFAR FAMAS Assault Rifle that just came to Black Ops 3 not too long ago. So, hopefully you guys do enjoy today's gameplay. It is absolutely insane. Not This isn't easy to do. Like, this is not, 100 KD gameplay, not an easy task, only one death, and uh, this gameplay is by Carnage Isotonic. So before I get any further into the game, Play. Let me talk about Carnage Isotonic real quick. He's an absolutely insane player. He's just over 12,000 subscribers and deserves a lot more. So make sure to go to his channel and check him out. His link will be right at the top of the description below. So make sure to go over there and uh, see his gameplay. <laughs> There's some crazy FFAR gameplay that you guys haven't seen yet. And you definitely want to check out uh, just some crazy stuff. He's been grinding out a ton because he managed to get this weapon uh, fairly early on when the when the new DLC weapons just dropped and uh, he got his hands on the FFAR, which is one of the best assault rifles in the game. Uh, that's at least what a lot of people think. It's very accurate. It's basically like the FAMAS. It's, it's almost identical to the FAMAS that we're used to from previous Call of Duties, and it's awesome to see it return. Uh, it, it's very accurate. It, it has a good mobility, like, has good mobility with it, and uh, it's a weapon that you definitely want to have. Unfortunately, because it's in supply drops, not many people have it, uh, which is really unfortunate. And I was hoping to get it, but I didn't. When I opened my free, like, weapon uh, supply drop, I only got, uh, I got, like, the I think it was the like Brass Knuckles and the Sword, the Fury Song Sword, which is pretty cool, but didn't get any of the new weapons that came out that day, like the Baseball Bat, which I wanted, or the FFAR, or the L4 Siege, which was pretty sick, uh, but this weapon is one of the best weapons of the game, and Carnage Isotonic also already managed to get Dark Matter on this weapon, uh, which is pretty dope as well. So, with all this being said, and with this being a 100 KD gameplay, I want to know what your highest KD that you've ever gotten in a single game. What's the highest KD? Uh, you know, maybe it's it's not just a, a one like a, a, a 64 KD like with with only one death. Um, maybe it's not something crazy like that, but maybe you got like a 10 KD or a 15 KD in a game, something insane like that. I want to know uh, what your highest KD is down in the comment section below. And I can't remember what mine is, otherwise I would tell you. Uh, I, I can't even like remember what my highest KD is in like a previous Call of Duty, which is really kind of shitty that I don't remember that. But uh, I do know that I, I've gotten like 10 KD gameplays obviously before. Um, but I don't I don't know if I've ever gotten like a 20 or 30 KD gameplay. I don't think I have uh, because I suck. Not really, but maybe I do. I don't know. But anyways, guys, make sure to check out Carnage Isotonic's channel. Like I said, his link will be right at the top of the description below. Don't forget to do that. Now, I do want to mention the Call of Duty trilogy that is coming out. I want to talk about that. That's the thing I'm going to be talking about here in today's video. Uh, and that is the Modern Warfare trilogy that Activision has put together and is putting out. And the huge disappointment behind uh, this whole thing at the tap. So as you guys might have heard, they've made this trilogy, they're putting together the three Modern Warfares uh, into a single disc, and it's not what we expected it to be. We thought that maybe they would put this uh, trilogy on the uh, next-gen or current-gen consoles, the, on the PS4 and the Xbox One, so that we would get to play these games on updated graphics and like in a better on a better console, obviously. But that's not what they did. They actually decided to put it on last-gen, on the Xbox 360 and on the PS3, and it's coming out this summer which is just really unfortunate I was looking when I first heard this I said this is this is actually happening like right this is actually happening that, that thing from the office like that little meme from the office with Steve Carell that's exactly what was happening like, it's happening it's happening that's what I imagined like I was super excited I couldn't wait to play Modern Warfare 3 on current gen consoles like Modern Warfare 2 would be cool and all but Modern Warfare 3 man that's my favorite Call of Duty I absolutely love that game and I had the most time played on it and I was just really looking forward to getting the chance to play it on updated graphics and like better consoles so my dreams were crushed but it is what it is and I'm still happy that they're putting that together and, and releasing something during the summer because obviously a lot of people are gonna buy that uh, but it's it's kind of still sucks it's not what we expected uh, but let me know in the comment section below alongside your highest KD if you're getting that trilogy and if you're gonna spend the time to like hook up your your old gen console your 360 or PS3 just to play that uh, because right now my Xbox 360 sadly is just like chilling in the closet it's collecting dust and and uh, it, every time I open my closet to get something, I feel so sad when I see it. Cause it's just it's my childhood sitting on a shelf collecting dust, and I remember so many things that have happened, like when playing different games, and like through middle school or like the end of middle school into high school, all of high school, with, like my all my friends and stuff, just playing games on that console. It's just good times, and it's just now sitting there doing nothing, and it makes me sad. I just wanna I wanna plug it in and give it give it life again and bring it back to life, so it just it can breathe, man, through its fence. But I don't know, man. 
anyways, hopefully you enjoyed today's gameplay, guys. An absolutely insane gameplay by Carnage Isotonic. Once again, check his channel out. I know I've said that several times, but I don't want only like 100 of you to go over there. Two, three, or 400 of you should go over there and uh, see the, the, the gameplays he's, he's managed to get with the FFAR uh, assault rifle because he, he got the weapon. He literally got like nuclears and 100 plus gameplays with it right away. I'm going to say that there's one. He gets over, I'm going to say it's more than 100, but he gets way over 100 kills solo with this weapon. And that's a gameplay that you do not want to miss. That's just a perfect example of why you should go over there right now. Uh, and one other thing I want to say real quick is I thought it was kind of funny. When this weapon first came out, everybody was calling it the fear. Uh, I don't know what that's called. It's not like dy dyslexia or anything. I don't know what that's called, but everyone was seeing it wrong. Since it's F-F-A-R, people were seeing the second F like as an E, uh, because obviously the F and the E are only like one, there's only one line difference with those two letters, but I just thought it was kind of funny that people were getting the two confused. Because I remember when the, uh, when the weapons first came out, there was a bunch of YouTube videos getting uploaded, uh, like new fear assault rifle, new fear nuclear, like people were calling it the fear and, and then people realized it was the F-F-A-R and people were changing titles. I thought that was really funny. I don't know if you guys noticed that, but I saw it all over the place by a whole bunch of different YouTubers. But anyways, guys, hopefully you're having a fantastic day. Hopefully you enjoyed today's video. If we could shoot for a thousand likes, that'd be absolutely insane. It definitely deserves a thousand likes. If not, it's completely fine. Subscribe to Carnage Clan if you are new. Follow us on Twitter. Links will be in the description. And once again, if you check out Carnage Isotonic's channel, his link will be at the top of the description. And I'll talk to you guys later.